Hi, my name is James Turner and this is the Vision 444 and I'm going to take you through on a walkthrough. So yeah, the first cool thing I want to show you is uh, our side access door. This is uh, very unique and uh, makes the boat nice and accessible. What I really like about it is uh, it's just so easy to use and you've got uh, really strong you can handle up to uh, about 500 kilograms on this uh, this side door it's so easy for coming on and off uh, boarding loading um, yeah really great uh, piece of kit some of the details we do we've got uh, built-in safety bars and they just screw in like this uh, you've got two one at the bottom one at the top um, nice and quick and easy We've also made additional washboards uh, uh, or transom washboards here and they really just, um, you know, when you're making passage and you're out at sea and you've got stuff lying in your cockpit, they're really just there so it just encloses you. They do have scuppers so it can let water out but it just means if you put something on your deck you don't have to worry about it rolling off, off your uh, sugar scoops when you're out at sea. Also another nice detail, uh, if you come look nice and closely here, is what we've done with these um, safety bars is we've got inserts so if you do damage the thread you can remove the insert uh, put a new threaded bolt in there and off you go so all very serviceable all our hatches um, they all got um, gas struts on them stainless steel 316 um, which makes it nice for just holding everything up while you're working inside there got a nice action so it's got a soft soft open and soft close uh, action to them if we look through the cockpit here we've got a real nice open space cockpit uh, I've made all the seats as wide as possible um, they really work well as a day bed um, or if in a real tropical place if somebody wants to lie there and sleep they can so you now if you put your enclosure around your bimini you've got uh, you know, great outdoor space uh, also all our boats come with these uh, lovely uh, teak tables we've got another detail here we've uh, we fitted a live bait well system um, cool about this one is it does salt water or fresh water um, pump just pumps continuous water flow and then it's got an overflow so it's a bit like a power boat uh, live bait system another thing you'll notice is we've got like a teak look flooring this is eva decking as you see when i push with my finger it's it's a uh, it's soft it's a uh, it's a bit like a high quality yoga mat and great under foot foot uh, great grip um, the wetter it gets the grippier it becomes so here we've got what we call a brush finish. So you'll see we've got nice lines here. Um, and this gives a more traditional wooden look. And on the side decks here, we use a embossed finish. So um, simpler, plainer, more uniform type finish. Uh, this is our helm station. Uh, also try to keep it as clean, as simple, and neat and functional as possible. We've got a nice fold down uh, teak step. Um, which is really cool when you're standing at the helm um, we've kind of designed it so the boat can be controlled single-handedly you've got your two primary winches this controls everything uh, main halyards jib sheets main sheets spinnaker halyards uh, all your all your control lines there's plenty space for two people to sit comfortably um, on this helm seat also the step gives you a bit more access for shorter people like myself be able to uh, reach forward and also to give me better visibility for my port bow uh, especially when I come to dock we've uh, got two built-in rope bins we've got a rope bin over here which we built in and we have another rope bin on this side so it keeps all the control lines nice and neat then underneath the helm we have a tall and skinny uh, locker here and this is ideal for storing uh, shore power leads uh, additional warp uh, mooring lines or even your hose pipe so that's a great little um, place to store those uh, 
objects which don't always lie so nicely in your lockers. Then you'll notice I'm standing on top of a, a big uh, grating here. So we've got a big dump. If you do take a wave on, this will dump a huge amount of water. Um, so it allows you to really uh, get rid of that excess water. Another thing you'll notice is all our support struts and davits are not just bolted on, they're all built into the boat. Uh, they're all foam sandwich composite, which makes it really strong and really light. And it's uh, nice that they're all integrated into the boat. Off the center line here, uh, you'll see we deploy our life raft off the, off the stern here. Um, we've just got these quick release uh, red uh, tags that you pull and you pull those and you can shoot your life raft out. The reason why we positioned it there, it's that it's fully accessible. So when you're in the cockpit or heaven forbid, if you capsize, you can access it from the bridge deck upside down. So we take both scenarios into account. Then uh, another cool feature we've got is we've got a, we can open our sliding hatch here and this just gives us you know, more access. Um, if you're going through a narrow passage uh, like the knives and the heads and people want to stand up and look where they're going, it's just another place for people to stand safely and also enjoy the view and be part of the whole sailing experience. If the weather gets bad and you've got a bit of rain, you can close it all in and we've got drop downs that you can put on and just gives you that more protection.